Uh, very good afternoon to all. We would like uh, to welcome everyone to IHM Shalom. Today we'll be demonstrating on different bakery products made out of buckwheat. Here in the institute also we have started with the orientation program in which we have showcased to the uh, participants regarding the uh, byproducts of buckwheat and also uh, how healthy it is. Since it is a loss uh, ingredients, we are trying to take out these ingredients and incorporate in our cuisine so that the people of Meghalaya as a whole and the world also will come to know about these ingredients of buckwheat. Tiada kesin kepada ningkong kebangang layak semua sibun mahas panguni u judging bam tang balong apa juyo bangan penan kam lani bangan ketai u tiem tak kesin layak judging mentoh sibun ha dah keba ni layak eki 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 ba kila hikai kum no ban le ke proses kum no ban bel u kum no ban penyak syakmat bangin laban penteri kam u yau ni u judging bam buckwheat is something bangi girang girang susiam thamai menta. Lingba kini kau Meghalaya Farmers Commission. Di Lingba uni bakwit bakiwan ra, and kini kau training kau bakilai, kau faculty members, kau trainers, kau lalang kau bayar apa tu kata. Tapi nombor dua uni uni uflo, ulang ubatang ham thamai. Di ulang gluten free, hak kau baking industry, benar kau dah dan tan gluten ru, kau jingbam, kau numpuan, kau kum kau jingkau kau jingi. Di kau muka Lingba kini kau training, kau layu aru ban, kau ra ya kini kau, ya kini kau baking items Lingba u. New buckwheat. Attending this program, uh, I have learned many things regarding the buckwheat that uh, it is a healthy uh, crop and like um, we can use this buckwheat for different ways of cooking. It's indeed a great training which we had here at IHM and I had the privilege where I had the opportunity to utilize the facilities here at IHM Shalom. Thanks, uh, thank goes to the Meghalaya Farmers Commission for organizing such a wonderful program and Raicham Shalom for hosting this seminar today. I had gained a lot of knowledge regarding buckwheat and the various products which can be produced from this crop. So uh, I look forward to the various products which can be produced from this crop. Uh, now we'll show you the making of the soba noodles. Soba noodles are the traditional Japanese noodle which they make. Again, out of buckwheat. Today we had a training program under the Global Buckwheat Festival which is going to be held on 9th and 10th of September. Today we did a little training program for entrepreneurs, for first timers, for students to give an awareness on buckwheat and as a product where it can be incorporated. They were taught on several bakery products and how buckwheat can be used as a substitute instead of flour and many bakery products were showcased and taught there after that in the second half of the day 
they were taught on the cookery aspect where buckwheat can be used in several savory dishes from their starters uh, to the main course several indian dishes were displayed chinese dishes continental dishes and japanese dishes buckwheat is also uh, have many health benefits so to this training program it has really benefited the participants in showcasing the different products made out of buckwheat the participants have uh, opened up their mind to new ideas and we had lots of discussion and interaction whereby now they can showcase more of their uh, signature dish which have been um, demonstrated today to this training program this training is basically meant as an awareness to make all of you aware of the uh, potential of buckwheat uh, on the 9th and 10th of uh, September, the Institute will host the event for the uh, showcasing of buckwheat where we will be hosting around 1000 farmers from all over the state of Meghalaya which includes the chefs from uh, Japan, then uh, includes our uh, national chef also like Ifka uh, and they will be also here to incorporate the recipe of buckwheat and its byproducts so that this buckwheat can be incorporated in our cuisine. As the government of Meghalaya has grown buckwheat all over the district of Meghalaya, I hope that the people also will become aware and try to use in their everyday meal of the day.